guys, the new Carbon 49 wire from Savage Gear and the new single barrel crimps in the matte black finish is an awesome uh, product here to perfect your line through trouts and all of your traces and stingers for your predator fishing. I'm just going to show you how to get the best of the Carbon 49 with our line through trout. So the carbon wire comes in a 0.48 millimeter, a 0.60 millimeter and a 0.70 millimeter. So the bigger the lure you're throwing, the bigger the fish you're catching, use the thicker wire. And we have matching crimps for all uh, three sizes of the Carbon 49 wire. So let me show you how simple it is to use the wire together with the crimps. First thing I need is the cut and crimping plier, a new product from Savage Gear here. And I will show you how easy it is to re-brick the line through trout with our new little line through modifier. So the line through modifier, as you can see, is a small little stainless steel hook here where you can put your treble hook on so that your treble hook is actually on the outside uh, of the line through trout. So you can still uh, attach it up in the belly or you can use the line through modifier depending on what kind of fish you're after. Let me show you how to use it. First thing I do is I take a piece of wire, and in this case about 40 centimeters or so, and I cut that right off. Then I take a matching crimp. In this case, it's the size XL that is 1.6 millimeter on the inside diameter. And I put the first crimp on, like so. So once you put the crimp on, you just put the wire through the little loop here, take it back through the crimp. And I, I like the crimp to be just the right size. That's why we have three different sizes of crimps to match each size of the wire. So I put out a little excess piece of wire, like two to three millimeter, and then I pull down my loop till it has the size that I want. For this particular rig, I kind of like it to be small and neat, so it's just perfectly looking like that. Then I take my Savage Gear cut and crimp plier, and for the single barrel crimps, I use the smallest jaw here with the teeth in, and I just put in the crimp like so, so it's sticking out on each side, and then I firmly press down just with one hand like that, and I can see that my crimp is perfectly crimped down on both wires. And I can then take my hook and put that into the hole. And then I can try to pull and I can really pull hard to see that that's perfect. So perfect little tool for this job. I then take the other end of my wire. I pass it up through my line through trout and I can then close off with a perfect little loop at the other end and I'm basically ready to fish. So in this case here, I'm not going to put a little swivel or split ring. I'm just going to uh, have that straight in the loop. And I put that back through and I leave a nice little round loop for my snap. Just like that. I put that into the crimping plier. One hand, pull as hard as I can, ready to go. Then I can take my line through modifier and that actually goes up in the belly of the trout and catches that little slot where the hook is normally sitting. And you can see when I pull nice and hard, that almost disappears inside. It looks really stealthy and perfect. And then you have the treble hook sitting under the belly, swimming, swinging loosely when the lure is actually swimming. So when the pike attacks it, which is very often does right on the belly here, it just hits that treble hook, boop, and it's hooked. And the line through trout goes up the trace and the pike cannot damage the lure or throw the lure with the weight of the lure. So perfect little addition here to the line through family is the line through modifier. So that's how you rig effectively your line through trout with a new carbon 49 wire.